It has been a rough morning in Santa Ana after fire tore through an apartment building. Three people were injured, including one person who police are now questioning. CBS 2's Candace Crone has the story. It took 80 firefighters about 45 minutes to put out this fire. You can see how it gutted a portion of the building. Well, right now, investigators are trying to figure out how and why this fire started. Fire was just coming out of the room and shooting up to the third floor. Flames tore through the second and third floors of this Santa Ana apartment complex overnight. Dozens of people were forced to evacuate with just the clothes on their backs as they watched at least eight units burn. I just grabbed my wife, woke her up, and ran down, got my car, and just took off. Nacho Tellis escaped unharmed, but three others were hurt. Paramedics took one man to the hospital in critical condition. Two other women suffered minor injuries. Investigators say one of those women was detained for questioning in connection with the fire. That subject made some statements uh, that led them to believe that they better just keep an eye on her and hold, uh, detain her until they they can further question her. Firefighters say the building used to be a motel and does not have sprinklers. Crews worked quickly to save as much of it as they could. This is an older style building, non sprinkler, so the potential for this building to be basically burned down was there, and the firefighters did a great job at stopping it. And the Red Cross was called in to help those 18 people displaced. Investigators are looking into the exact cause of the fire. Reporting in Santa Ana, Candace Crone, CBS 2 News.